Welcome to my channel. Are you a Telegram user? I recently started using it when I engaged in Tony Robbins programs and more recently a lot of my friends joining the channel a way to start messaging each other, getting off of Facebook Messenger. Hallelujah. I have some exciting news here. ManyChat announced two new platforms for chatbot marketing and that's the Telegram platform as well as WhatsApp. In this session, I'll focus on connecting my Smarty the Realtor chatbot to a Telegram channel, and then we'll create some compelling default replies as well as welcome messages so that when friends and family and other folks are messaging me, the chatbot will take care of an engaging conversation even if I'm sleeping. So let's dive in and take a look. And before we dive in, if you haven't subscribed, I appreciate you subscribing to the channel and hit that bell because in the coming weeks, I have some exciting news on a new digital business card I'll be giving away for free, as well as I'll be attaching the What's Up channel to my Smarter the Real Order page to put compelling conversations on that channel as well. So let's dive into ManyChat and I'll show you how you start your journey of a Telegram chatbot. Okay, over here on the ManyChat side, on your main dashboard, if you start out looking this way at the Learning Hub on the main home page, come over to Insights and you'll see all the channels that you're currently working on. With the Smarty the Realtor page here in Philadelphia, I do marketing for buyers, sellers, and renters. Uh, and I do that across Facebook Messenger, Instagram, SMS, and email. And I have my subscribers down here, my current counts. Uh, my ProEdge chatbot does a job of pruning the bot, so at any given time, some months I may have thousands of people on Facebook Messenger uh, talking to my bot, but if they don't give me emails and phone numbers and they're really not a good lead, the chatbot will do the pruning for me. So this is my active count that I have as of June of 2022. As I come down here, you have your channels. So over in here, um, I can add a channel here, and these are the two remaining channels that uh, ManyChat supports that I have not connected yet to my chatbot. Uh, I'm gonna focus on Telegram now, and then in the coming weeks, I'll do WhatsApp, and I'll create a chatbot for the WhatsApp platform and show you how to do that as, in addition to Telegram. So let's hop into Telegram and let's see how this works. So it says, do you want to uh, start you know, with a new, and this is the first time I'm doing it, so we'll kind of go through it together. You could either connect an existing bot or a new bot. I've never done this before, so I'm going to say new bot. It's going to ask me to open up Telegram and go to the bot father in Telegram and type in the word new bot uh, in the instructions and follow it. And down here, it looks like there's a token required. So let me pause and head over to Telegram and let's take a look at uh, what is happening on the Telegram side. Okay, over here on the Telegram side, looks like my wife sent me a nice little uh, gif here of the two of us uh, as a funny message. Um, you're seeing this live in action. So uh, from the instructions, we need to look at bot father. So I'm just gonna start typing to look for the bot father and there it is. So I'll go ahead and hit bot father and it looks like it's telling me what to do. Uh, it tells me uh, the, the setup and what we need to do is hit the uh, start. So now on the start, um, these are the uh, different commands you can do. And to create a new bot at the very top, you'll see it's forward slash new bot. So that's what I'm gonna type in here. I'm gonna say forward slash new bot uh, and hit enter. And this is all right, a new bot, are you gonna, uh, what are you gonna call it? Um, so I'll call it smarty bot. I'll call it Smarty Telebot. And uh, the good news is uh, that is now my name. So uh, in here, um, it is available. So over here, let's choose a username. So I'll call it Smarty the Realtor Bot. So over here, uh, it, again, nobody else is using it on Telegram, so it is giving me that name. Now, I, I'm assuming like if I tried to put in a name that was already used, the bot father would have said, hey, that name's already taken, pick another name, so you will need to take another name. So over here you have your uh, token, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab the token uh, right here, and I'm gonna come back to ManyChat, and we're gonna paste it into the chat system. So I'll pause here and go back to ManyChat. Okay, over here back on the ManyChat side, I already copied the token. All I need to do is paste that token into that field and hit connect. 
So it looks like so far so good. Congratulations, the uh, Smarty Telebot is connected. So I now have an official chatbot connected to the system. Now it's also saying, do you wanna subscribe uh, this bot uh, for updates? Uh, this is for many chat. I'm gonna say yes, because I definitely want to um, uh, use this as a starting point. So uh, I'm now gonna go over to uh, the uh, Telegram again and connect to the mini chat Telegram channel because they're going to show me all kinds of new tips and tricks for Telegram. So I'm going to want to subscribe. So let's. Okay, so once you hit the subscribe button, it opens up Telegram again. And what we're connecting to now is the many chat uh, Telegram account. Uh, it's beneficial to do that because I'm now connected to the many chat support group and they're going to be giving me lots of tips and tricks on how to use this channel. So what I want to do is uh, you'll see it's a many chat help system. I'll hit get started. And again, it's now making a connection. You've successfully signed up for Telegram. Thanks for your subscription to the ManyChat Assistant. We'll always be here to help you navigate. So this is a great uh, way if I need to message the ManyChat support team, I can use Telegram and start messaging them as another channel. And I could say, uh, very, very excited to be here. Right, I'll just send them a little message. So, uh, so basically that's it on the Telegram side. So I've now subscribed to the ManyChat Telegram account. My chatbot's connected. So now let's go back to ManyChat and fi finalize this. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you the settings like a default uh, reply and a welcome message. In chatbot marketing, you wanna now put a compelling message so when people respond to you on your channel, the bot will start talking to them. So let's hop back over to ManyChat and let's set up that conversation. Okay, back on ManyChat, the final step here is dealing with the settings in Telegram, setting up the welcome message, the default reply, and then how do you create chatbots for Telegram with the different conversations you wanna have. So over here on uh, the uh, Smarty the Realtor chatbot channel, uh, you'll see Telegram is here. What you wanna do is you wanna come down to settings. You wanna go to Telegram. Now on the Telegram side, you'll see that I have the bot name, the username, and then over here you have the default reply and the welcome message. These are already set up for me by ManyChat. I'm gonna go over and show you how to edit these. You also need to have an opt-in and an opt-out message. So these are also set up by ManyChat. So if I hit edit, you'll see this is a basic flow that if somebody types the word start or subscribe to your channel, first time they message you, it'll opt them into Telegram and then it'll send them a message. Now, because these are flows, you can make these say anything you want. So if I come over to automation, you'll see in the main folder, these are the flows that you just saw in the settings, including the welcome message. So let's take a look at the welcome message and let me show you how this works. And look, it's the same type of flow using the flow builder in ManyChat as it was with Instagram and Messenger I've been using forever. So I have all these flows in my chatbot package. I'm excited about this, that it has the same capability. Let's take a look at what you can do. Well, for starters, the starting step, you'll see the welcome message is not enabled. So I'm gonna leave it uh, not enabled yet. Um, but I also have the triggers. So if I want to, I could do a, um, and I have a, a videos on my channel, check those out, advanced videos around using uh, QR codes, uh, buttons on a website, uh, and so forth. I can have all different ways to get them into this conversation from the starting step. But in this case, this is gonna use um, the welcome message, which is the first time they come visit you on Telegram, this is the message they'll see. So let's hop in and say, what does that message look like? Now you may want an image and you can move these up. So over in here, you have an image of you. You may wanna say hi. And then over here, you say first name. So you can do the same thing you're doing in message marketing. Um, I could say, how are you? And then maybe put a little emoji with the uh, sunglasses. Um, so you could have a picture of yourself, a logo, whatever you want here. Now, as you look here, all the same capabilities are here, including a Telegram menu. So as a realtor, you could have a menu about, you know, scheduling time on your calendar, uh, buying a home, selling a home, getting an ebook, all the different things you could do in chatbot marketing. Again, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe and check out those uh, playlists I have. Uh, I'm all about uh, chatbot marketing as well as other technology that's going to make us realtors uh, uh, have more leads, close more transactions, and make our life easier through technology. 
Uh, over here, I have different things I can do here. I can do images, videos, audios, files, delays, user inputs, and dynamic displays. So all these uh, are covered in more detail. I have a video a couple of weeks ago. I'll put a link here on Bot 101. Uh, you can watch that, and I go through constructing a bot and what you can do with uh, conditions and action steps and the different actions here. So make sure you check that video out if you haven't already seen it. So uh, when, once you're done, you'll hit publish. Now I didn't do an image, so I can hit that X uh, and just have a very simple flow right here. Now there's one more ninja trick. Now I'm not sure if this is gonna work, so stay with me. Um, I built a very comprehensive chatbot for real estate, so the last thing I wanna do is have to build flows from beginning to end for all these activities that I have. So uh, for example, I have a digital business card. And stay tuned in the next week or so, I have a free gift for everybody. I'll be giving out a complimentary business card and chatbot marketing for anybody that wants it. Um, I'm finishing touches on it. I'm gonna have a little training course on how to set it up. You're gonna love it. Uh, make sure you watch that video. But the last thing I wanna do is have to recreate each of these flows. This is my business card that gets into all kinds of actions. So what I'm thinking is, and see if this will work, is in the ninja trick, there's these three dots on the right hand side. And if you click on that, ManyChat has this convert ch uh, channel capability. So when I say convert, I'm on this flow that you're looking at is a Facebook Messenger flow. I could say select channel and I can make this an Instagram, an SMS, or here it is, Telegram flow. So with a couple clicks, I've now just created an entire flow in Telegram by taking my Messenger flow and making a copy of it on a different channel. Thank you ManyChat for that capability. I'll be able to put all my key flows in the ProEdge chatbot package onto this channel like I did with Instagram a while ago to make these a very compelling chatbot for each of the channels that your clients are talking to you on. I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, consider giving me a like uh, and uh, give me some comments what you think. I will be going over attaching what's up in the next week or two as I want to get that channel going as well because I have international agents on my team and we're always using WhatsApp and I have other clients that are uh, using the WhatsApp uh, app as well. So I want to make sure that no matter where my clients reach me on what channel, um, there'll be a compelling message from my chatbot to get the lead over to me. We'll see you on the next video.